Okay, guys, here we go. We got the Blink XT2 outdoor, indoor, wire free, high def, smart security camera. I opted for the two cameras uh, in one box system. These things are, it says it's easy to install. You can mount them anywhere. They're wire free, uh, weatherproof, all that good junk. And here we go, right here. Uh, here's the two cameras. Here's your packaging, like your information pamphlets and all that stuff. Oh, this is going to be a little sticker for the outside of your house. It says monitored by or protected by Blink Video Security Systems. Thanks for purchasing, blah, blah, blah. We want to ensure you have a great experience. Here's your little setup guide. All right, so the first thing it's going to tell you to do is to activate this. All right, I'm going to go ahead and set this up, and I'll be right back. So the Blink X-T2 cameras are going to come with motion activated instant on recording. They will feature two-way audio so you can talk to somebody that's at the front door, they can hear you. They're wireless. They have free cloud storage which is not offered by many brands. Up to two years of battery life, depends on how you use the motion activation on them. It's an IP65 weather resistant, 1080p image, live video outside temperature monitoring, they're indoor, outdoor cameras. These are gonna be shots of video during the daytime. This is a live video feed right here of my front porch. And then I'm gonna go ahead and give you a shot of the back. This is also gonna be a live video right here of my backyard. So into the settings here, you can see, you can name the camera, gives you battery status, outdoor temperature. Um, you get quite a few different little uh, tweaks that you can do to it. You got speaker volume. You can enable or disable the microphone. Uh, the early detection, detection, the early notification beta, I do like that. Um, this right here, you can go in and you can see the grade areas where my chairs are at. And up by the road in the driveway, the camera will not catch um, anything that's grayed out so if you want to just make sure that you know if I'm sitting up there I don't want the camera to keep giving me notifications or something so it's pretty nice that they give you an advanced thing like that uh, to do that with um, the sensitivity levels on this are pretty good this is a little nighttime right here I do run two lights in the back of my porch actually they're blue and red all right, just to go over a couple of things, I would highly recommend these cameras. I spent a little, about a week with them now and uh, got them all adjusted to the right angle and everything. And I think they're, they're very, very good value um, for what you're getting, you know, value for money or whatever. And uh, I've tried a couple other cameras in the past year or so and I, I didn't really like them. I returned them immediately. If you can hear the birds chirping in the background, I don't know if you can. They're pretty, pretty lively this morning. I just wanted to give you guys a different view besides my usual recording spot. But, uh, you know, you can see right up there, got one of the back cameras going. And it's not sending me any activation alerts right now. Um, so it's not just going to steadily be, just be blowing you up with uh, alerts just for no reason. You know, it's going to give you the major alerts. It's, it's, all, it's all on how you're going to set the sensitivity on it. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and link down below um, to Amazon. You go figure out your own package you want. I got the two package with the module, the sync module. Uh, that sync module will hold up to 10 cameras on one module. And then you'll have to get a new module. 
Uh, they have add-on cameras after you get the initial package, um, whatever package you choose again. You know, I think I'm gonna add one or two more cameras and I think that'll be about perfect around my house. Like I say, you can use these indoor or outdoor. Uh, they're completely weather resistant. Uh, I'm also gonna link this back camera right up here. Where is it at? Right there, that back camera. I used a, a aftermarket mount on it um, because the mount that came with it uh, didn't go at quite the angle that I wanted it to. I have a huge backyard. I wanted to be able to see all of it and all of my patio and stuff. So I had to have it at a certain angle. Um, but hey, you know, they're great. I really do like these cameras and um, for the price point that they're at, I think they're, they're excellent. And again, I would definitely highly recommend them. Uh, just if you get them, tweak with the settings a little bit. If you got any questions about that, hit me up in the comments below. I'll help you tweak. I'll show you what settings I got mine on and uh, we can go there and help each other out. Um, if you found a different camera that you like using besides the Blink X-T2, um, drop that down below too. I'd love to hear about the new one you got. Um, and uh, oh, by the way, these do work with Alexa too. It'd be nice if they worked with HomeKit uh, for Apple because I run Apple, but they don't. But uh, the app is very intuitive and it works very seamless. You know, there's a, just a small second, about a three second delay from the time you get a notification um, from the time it actually starts recording. So it's going to start recording and about three seconds later, you're going to get a notification. If you access the notification on your lock screen where it pops up at, it'll take you right into a live feed. If you go into the app, you can see it'll have a little tally down at the bottom of videos that it's stored. It'll give you a five second clip is what I got mine set on. You can set them longer than that, but I figure five seconds and uh, give me everything I need to get somebody's face on the camera or whatever, you know. So, all right, man, give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Uh, thumbs down if you don't, that's your prerogative. Uh, again, I'd love to hear your comments down below. I'm gonna go ahead and link some more information down below on these cameras and uh, check them out because they really are, really are cool. All right, guys, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks, bye.